Welcome to day seven for Vlogmas. I don't know what I'm doing. This morning, uh, the video was the David's Tea Sweet Tart and I put some of it in a jar because I wanted to taste it cold. I love how red it is. Hopefully I don't spill it all over my sweater. That is amazing. I would definitely take this over strawberry rhubarb parfait. Yes, that is great. Okay, so on the plans for today, I have to go get some groceries and go to the farmer's market and then hopefully convince Jeanette to get our treat. <laughs> right, Jeanette? Right. Yes, because we still don't have our Christmas tree up and we need it up. Mm. Okay, let's go. Okay, that was so, <laughs> it's so chilly out. But we managed to score some really nifty things from the market. I kind of like it when Jeanette lets me go by myself. <laughs> let's me. <laughs> when, because then I can just snag up all the interesting things that I want to try <laughs> and sneak them home. <laughs> all right, off to the grocery store next is my next mission. back home got the breakfast sandwich from Jamali's I love that place this is the sandwich it might look weird but it is amazing tasting it is delicious anyways I'm going to eat this with Jeanette and maybe figure out what we're doing for today okay sandwich is done Time to open an advent. <laughs> Today's seven? Seven. Seven. I have high hopes for this. I think I'm going to love it. I don't even know what it is. Try not to break the box. Am I gonna love it? <laughs> Sweet ginger! <laughs> oh dear. That's probably gonna love that. Sweet ginger. Big in ginger flavor, loaded with sweetness and full of spice. Oh, maybe. Let's hear the ingredients. 50% ginger, licorice root, and cinnamon. Hmm. We have three advents this day. Let's open up Fortnum's while we're at it. Day seven. Oops. This one always hurts my finger. raspberry and nettle infusion. Interesting. I'm a beauty vlogger. Boop, boop, boop. See what it has in it. <laughs> 
Beautifully sharp, then blissfully mellow to taste. This bright red infusion is warming, fruiting, fruiting. <laughs> Fruity. <laughs> and I don't, Jeanette, can you help me? R E D O L E N T. Redolent? Is that how you say that? What was it again? I wonder if it's like a UK common word and R E D O. Mm hmm O L E N T. Redolent? Strongly reminiscent or suggestive of fragrant or sweet smelling. Hmm. Learn something new every day. Mm. A rhubarb crumble, a refreshing and unique tipple. Tipple. Tipple? How do you spell that? T <laughs> like nipple, but T. <laughs> I figured I thought I would ask. Um, an alcoholic drink. Oh, a tipple. As a noun. Is it a noun or a verb? I don't know. What's the sentence? Um, a refreshing and unique tipple. Noun. I am going to use this word all the time now. So it means what? An alcoholic drink. <laughs> An alcoholic drink, but this is not. Tipple. Uh, it means an alcoholic drink? That's what the Oxford English Dictionary says. We're going to make ourselves a tipple later. <laughs> okay, that's all for now. Bye. <laughs> Jeanette. Oh, Jeanette. Look at all the treats. Our neighbor just gave these to us when we were bringing in our Christmas tree. So nice. There's our tree. Hello. <laughs> so I had a very nice nap. We had our Christmas tree up and clearly that tuckered me out. But this afternoon I did want to share with you, I did have one of the Fortnum's ones. Which one was it? The Assam TG FOP. And that was delicious. Hmm cold now but still good. I'm going to um, brew a little pot of tea and sit down and edit for a bit and maybe listen to who, some Christmas music and stuff and yeah see where we go. I'm going to have some Santa's secret. know if uh, David's Tea actually still sells these or not. They're giant bags. They are this here. And I find them handy if I don't want to um, use like a strainer or anything. Suppose I need water. I 
love this teapot. And this is the most adorable little bonbon from the farmer's market that we got. So cute. We got these from uh, friends for our wedding gift, actually. So we each got a pair with a cute teapot. Um, but it's a purple clay teapot. I, I save it for special teas. I um, have been brewing oolong in it, so yeah. Anyways. Uh, okay, so my tea is getting ready. I gave myself a little cookie. And this is Santa's Secret from David's Tea. It's a black tea and it's one of my holiday favorites. I really love it. I usually stock up before it um, before it goes out of stock for the season. And then I drink it all year long and then I usually run out sometime in the fall. So yeah, you can see our Christmas tree. I am so happy. It really brings me a lot of joy. So yeah, we'll let that settle before we start adding you know, the lights and stuff to it. So yeah. All right, gonna sit here at the table and edit. I don't know why, but I enjoy sitting at the table instead of the desk. <laughs> All right, final advent of the day is the Tea Thoughts one. And it's a 12 day and we are on day seven. Are we looking for four, five, Eight, twelve, four. Yay, it's a bigger one. <laughs> Here we go. That's the sheet that's going to tell us what it is, how to use it, all those good stuff. It's like Christmas morning all the time. I love it. And this is the wrapping paper that she designed. Look at that, isn't that so cute? Little Tika. What do you see? Ooh. It's a tea sample. Loose leaf tea, it has all the, this is so cute. Okay, let me show you. I, of course, cannot say half those words, but that's okay. <laughs> but look on the back. Oh, I'm not showing that tea upside down. There you go. It's so cute. Look at the little teapot. I love that. Let's see what she says. Verdant Tea. This is a fairly new tea brand to me. So cute. And I was excited to see that they had options to get samples. Every advent calendar has a sample and they are all different. Enjoy the surprise. Nice. So this is a black tea. Very nice. Spring 2019. Mm, we're going to try that tomorrow. All right, I'm gonna sign off for tonight. Um, hopefully maybe watch a Christmas movie and enjoy the smell of the tree and get that all decorated tomorrow. So yeah. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow. Um, chat down in the comments until next time. Take care, bye.